of the Zionist Union, a combined list of the Labour Party and the Hatnua Party, has broken up ahead of Knesset elections scheduled for April 9th. Labour Party leader Avi Gabay informed Tsipi Livni, leader of Hatnua, that he was dissolving the pact between the two factions. I had hoped and believed the change in party leadership and our new partnership would lead to our growth, said Gabay, but the public is wise, sees that isn't the case, and has moved away from us. Polls have shown a sharp decline in the number of seats the Labour Party is expected to win in the next elections. Benjamin Netanyahu says he will not resign as Prime Minister even if Israel's Attorney General's office moves ahead with corruption charges. I don't intend to resign because I believe there's nothing to the case. Second, Israel's a country of law, and according to the law, there's no reason to resign before the conclusion of the hearing. In a democracy, you establish who will be in power by the ballots, he said. Netanyahu made his comments on Monday during a press conference in Brazil, where he's visiting to attend the inauguration of President-elect Jair Bolsonaro. Israel's decision to leave the United Nations Educational, Scientific, and Cultural Organization, or UNESCO, took effect today. Marking the occasion, Israel's ambassador to the UN, Danny Danan, declared that UNESCO is a body that continues to rewrite history, among other things, by attempts to erase the Jewish connection to Jerusalem. Israel will not be a member of an organization dedicated to acting against it and which is a tool manipulated by Israel's enemies, he said. UNESCO has passed several resolutions denying Jewish ties to heritage sites in Israel. The IDF announced on Monday it has formed a new battalion to defend Israel's Western Galilee and fight Hezbollah should the terror group attack. The battalion has been named Gates of Fire and already had its first war training session last month, the IDF reported. It's not for nothing that our battalion is called Gates of Fire, said Colonel Roe Levy, who commands the division under which the new battalion is assigned. After we stop the enemy's plan of attack, it will be our turn to strike and subdue the organization on its territory, with the goal of opening the northern gates for the whole IDF.